You will suffer more pain than any other man could endure. Your bones will be coated in adamantium. When we're done, you'll be able to withstand anything. Even Creed. Where did you fight him, my Miss Box? is more important to me than his life. Don't even think about what the hell. Stand down, Captain. My brother, my responsibility. At my command. The operation was a success, but he can't be trusted. We have his DNA for Weapon 11. Terminate him. Well, if that doesn't get you excited for this game, I don't know what will. Ladies and gentlemen, my name is Blitzwinger and welcome to the gameplay walkthrough or potentially gameplay walkthrough for X-Men Origins Wolverine. It is finally time to play this game. This is one of the very few superhero games that I have not ever played, so I'm very excited to dive on in. Now, of course, guys, like I always say, if you do enjoy the gameplay walkthrough, hit the thumbs up button. That lets me know that you want it to actually be a gameplay walkthrough and then in addition to all of that i of course also would love to ask a question of the day and it is a pretty simple one and that is let me know what is your favorite member of the x-man and here we go activision presents a raven software production in association with marvel studios back when marvel studios was a thing and 20th Century Fox. I assume the logo, oh, I was gonna say Wolverine was gonna appear, in the not too distant future. Hmm, okay, let's see what we have in the not too, oh. Okay, things look very bleak. Oh, that took a, a turn for the worse very quickly. Very, very quickly. Is what I do. At least the people still living after I'm done doing it say that. Oof. Oh, and there's the star of the show. Catching dubs right away. Okay. Seems like uh, a little bit of a stealth operation here from some sort of an army. Oh no, I think I know what's going to happen. Oh my goodness. Okay, so yeah. If you're worried about, hey, is this game going to be uh, very Wolverine? Well, I think this answers your questions quite firmly, doesn't it? That's one of those times if you're that guy, you just go, run. Yikes. Getting bombarded by enemy fire. Gotta get a move on. Hey, finally, Wolverine showing a little bit of a sign of weakness. Everyone calls me Wolverine. I don't remember other names. Here we go! Holy moly. Okay, that was pretty freaking incredible. Holy moly. Bro, I just fought an entire army. Many years earlier. Nervous meat? You smell nervous. Better than how you smell, that's for sure. Boom, got him. Coming up. That's a body order joke. Coming up. Um, uh, that seems more like uh coming down, if you know what I mean. Uh okay, here we go. Uh, uh, am I in control? Oh, I am in control. Okay. So, this almost feels like something you'd see in like an uncharted game, right? Like this sort of a beginning. Whoa, okay, avoid the rockets though. 
And Nathan Drake would probably have a parachute. And probably not. Well, yeah, Uncharted wouldn't have this happening. <laughs> That's for sure. Oh my goodness, bro. This game is crazy. All right, well, here we go. So right off the bat, we have the opportunity for some combat. Mess up our enemies. Hold LT to block. Lay the smack down on that enemy. And see ya, dude. I don't think there's a parrying mechanism. At least maybe not. Oh, there is a parrying mechanism. Whoa! That was cool! Alright, messed him up. Slicing and dicing. Okay, so that's my heavy attack. Y is like a heavy jump attack. Whoa! I'm gonna dash forward. That dash ability is real nice. Can we deflect enemy gunfire? I don't think we can. I'm just gonna jump dodge. I think I got him. Ooh, okay, so as you can see, our health bar is actually filling back up, which is very nice and appropriate for the character, because after all, Wolverine is able to constantly heal, so I guess that would make sense. Um, I don't know how much exploring we should really be doing. I don't know how linear the game is. It looks kind of linear right now, but I guess for now, since this is kind of our first level slash tutorial, it would make sense that it should be somewhat simple, at least at the start. Anything behind the waterfall? There's always something behind the waterfall. <laughs> Classic. All right, so we have 500 experience, which makes me believe that there's probably a leveling system involved. Hold RB to lunge. Whoa, that is sick. Yo, that was cool. All right, that's a nice move. That is a very, very cool move. Oh, boy. That must be my chopper. I better see how Victor and the others are doing. Time to get to work. Okay. Here we go. Dive from above. Dash. Oof. I should have been able to block that. Dang it. Dodged. Ooh, look at that cool spin move. There is the parrying. Send him flying. And send the other guy packing as well. Ooh. Okay, what was over here that I destroyed? Interesting. What is happening right now? Oh, is this like a sense of smell or something like that? Kind of him figuring out how to get through there. Oh, yeah, there we go. Feral sense. All right, we get to shimmy a little bit. It's like I said, it really does remind me a little bit right from the start of Uncharted. Now, again, obviously, it's nowhere near as polished as Uncharted. I'm not trying to say that. But at least from a gameplay element perspective, kind of similar. And the setting, I guess, also being kind of a jungle sort of area. So... Definitely has that sort of vibe. Could we get our lunge attack? There we go. Close the gap with a big lunge attack. Oh my goodness. <laughs> well, we won that. We also leveled up, which is pretty freaking awesome. There's a big giant bridge and... Um... How do I fight a helicopter? I guess the same way. Oh, that seems mighty close. Ow, ow. All right, we're going to pull ourselves back up. One, two, and... Okay. Helicopter uh, smoothies. 
brand new uh, brand coming to your local X-Man shop. Courtesy of Wolverine. Um, okay. Yeah, that was crazy. <laughs> that was very, very crazy. But then again, I feel like I've been saying that a lot. And it's just crazy because this is my first time ever playing this game. So I, I'm kind of just going into it blind as far as like what to expect. What the heck? Bro thinks he's Human Torch. I'm going to do a charge up attack. Ooh. Oh, let's go. I'm going to back up. Dodge. Whoa, bro, 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 bro. Wolverine's on fire right now. And not in a good way. Okay. Sent him flying. I am healing back up. I'm going to get another charge up attack going. Ow. Oh, 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 oh. Ow, ow, ow. Okay, dash out of the way, Wolverine. Can we please dash out of the way? We got to get our health. To recuperate just a wee little bit. Can I do a grab attack? Oh! <laughs> that was crazy. Dude, the combat in this is actually surprisingly really, really cool. Like legitimately, I'm I'm quite impressed by the variety of offense. And I assume that there's more upgrades, right? So, like, eventually, I'll be able to get even more as far as combat is concerned in terms of variety. All right, I got a dash. I'm going to get a lunge attack. Oh, you have a ground attack as well. We got to close the gap on the long range attackers because they're just going to be constantly pinging damage our way. And we got him. Oh my goodness. All right. I can get up there. I do want to quickly take a peek and see if I could go over here. Is this even an option or no? Nope, seems like this is just a dead end. That leaves us with just one path to take, and that would be right through here. Does this lead anywhere? I don't think so. I wish you could dash while, like, when you air jump. That would be a really nice addition. Now, it's not, like, the most major thing, but it would be cool. All right, going across the super-duper sketchy bridge here. What could possibly go wrong? Well, there you go. I couldn't even finish my sentence before I already answered what could possibly go wrong. I also love that those guys are taking down the drawbridge, even though their own comrades are on the drawbridge. How does that make any sense? All right, I think I have to do a lunge to get across that gap. Oh, my goodness. Bro, what is this game? This is crazy. Whoa. Okay. Just sort of thwarted him away. Same with that guy. Ow. Yeah, having a long range weapon is definitely much nicer here. Defeated him as well. Ooh, we can actually jump on this as well. Cool. I wanted to test it. Okay, so some really cool sequences right off the bat. I'll, I'll say that much. Got him. Uh-oh. Oh. What the heck is that? What is that? That sounds like a dinosaur. Oh, okay. This is going to go bad. I, I, I can already tell. Okay. Whatever the heck that was. That was loud and large. I don't know what that thing was, but it was definitely some type of an animal, and it was loud, large, and probably not happy to see us, I would imagine. All right, I guess it's time to zip line. Let's party. Hello? 
Ow. Defeated him. Another enemy. I'm just going to use the lunge ability to try to close the gap as fast as possible. What is this? Can we drive this? That would have been cool. I love that they use the lunge ability as well. It's like they watch Wolverine. They're like, yo, that's pretty cool. We should definitely try that. Oh, 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 oh. I did not realize that those were... Yeah, okay, we gotta be careful around those canisters because they go ba 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 da beam ba da boom. Uh, some objects can be pushed or pulled. Oh, so let's push this thing down. And again, I hate to draw comparisons to Uncharted, but isn't this a very similar looking Jeep to the one that you get to drive in Uncharted? Except you don't drive it like this. <laughs> ta da! Wolverine is here! Whoa! Alright, we have rage abilities now. Not that I know how to activate it. I have a claw spin attack. We're getting all these new moves, but I don't know how to do them. Oh! I'm a Beyblade! Okay, that's a pretty powerful move. Lock in, lock in. Why can't I jump? I'm confused. There we go. Ow, ow, ow. Okay, this is definitely the most difficult fight so far. But thank goodness we leveled up. That legit just saved me right there. Had I not leveled up, it would have been GG well played. And we got our rage meter back up, which I think is the orange meter below our health bar. Oh boy. Here we go. Okay. We have another machete champion here. Couldn't even block that. But you know what I can do? I can spin to win. I can spin to win, buddy. Oh, maybe I shouldn't be spinning to winning. Does that seem to almost go terribly wrong? You know what I love? I love that as soon as we've dropped into this game, it has been nonstop crazy action sequence after crazy action sequence after crazy action sequence like <laughs> the game has not let up at all it's been just one thing after another after another after another like it, it's very 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 action-packed that's for sure it also makes me incredibly excited about the possibilities of what we might end up getting with insomniac's game you know just in terms of okay we go imagine like even this game but essentially like running at like 4k and like really really nice graphics it would look pretty sick right okay so wolverine can climb some surfaces i assume this is not one of them i assume this however is one of them yep because it has those kind of like vines almost we can climb that Come on, get him. Ooh, is this a shortcut? Huh. Where does this lead? Is there anything of significance here? Oh, there's something here. There's like a... What do you call this? Like a... I don't know. It looks like a vault door, doesn't it? I wonder if there's... Is there, like, a move that I could perform? Hmm. That's interesting. You can see this, like, light shining. It kind of makes me think that there might be something of value there, but... I guess at least as of right now, I can't really interact with it. Maybe it requires some type of a move that we don't have access to yet. 
So I suppose maybe eventually we'll unlock something. This is clearly the way to go. It does make me wonder why that was back there. Let me see. Maybe we can interact with it now. That would be interesting if there's now possibility to like maybe unlock a new costume. Obviously, that would be the most exciting thing. As much as I like the Logan attire, I would, of course, love to see a classic Wolverine like. Uh, oh, that's why there's dog tags here, which actually give you 500 XP. So that's definitely nice. All right. Let's keep it moving, I guess. Let's keep it moving. But yeah, like a classic yellow and blue attire would be sick. That would be really freaking cool. Hello! <laughs> that was such a funny scream for that enemy. Right as we're diving at him, he's just like, no, I changed my mind. I don't want to fight. Oh, here's that crazy sound again. Okay, that sounded more like a tiger this time. Because the first time that we heard it, I swear it sounded like a dinosaur. I was like, am I playing Jurassic Park or Wolverine? Um. So that's probably where we're supposed to go. So then what's up over here? Maybe another set of dog tags we could locate? Ooh. Yes! You found a classic Wolverine action figure, one of two. Find them all to unlock a bonus... Oh, bonus challenge. I thought bonus suit. I mean, that's cool. That's pretty cool, but I also kind of wish we would have... Kind of wish we would have found uh To be honest, found a suit. Maybe by doing the bonus challenge, though, maybe that's how you get a suit, right? That's possible, I suppose. Ooh, that enemy completely is unsuspecting that Wolverine is here now. And definitely none of this giant amount of noise that we just created is going to let him know that we're here. Okay, feral senses can be used to find your next objective. And how do we use them? Are you going to tell me like a button prompt? Like, hey, use this button. Use that button. It's not B is to grab, X is to light attack, Y is to heavy attack, A is to jump. R recenters the camera. And then I don't think any of our D... Oh, there. Okay, so it's up on the D-pad. Cool. Is there any point in destroying these? Oh, you get rage orbs from them. Nice. Okay, that is kind of cool. If you're having any trouble, and considering how powerful the rage attacks are, definitely a good idea to get those unlocked. I love that Wolverine is grunting and making all this noise, but somehow this enemy is not going to hear him. Oh, is he listening to music? Oh. See ya. <laughs> that was almost like a Batman moment right there. Oh. Well, this, this on the other hand, very not Batman. Oh. Hey, that guy got lucky. Hey. Oh. Not bad. All right, dude. Celebrate. you were lucky. Oh. <laughs> Dang it. Dang it. They got me. Oh, my goodness. Checking in. Yep. Why am I not surprised? I'm at the site now, sir. The pilot's here, but he's dead. There's no sign of the rest of the team. They parachuted out, but got scattered. How's Victor, sir? Your brother's fine. Rendezvous with him at a temple north of your position. You two will rig that area with the C4 he's carrying. Roger. Goes for a one out. Okay. Well, I guess we've got our uh, update. On the required task, which is to keep moving ahead, at least for now, we're going to turn off our feral sensibility, which is kind of almost like detective mode in Arkham Asylum, which is interesting. I actually wonder, did this game release before or after Arkham Asylum? That would be interesting to find out. Oh, what have we here? A wheel. All right. We spin and turn. And it seems like we have a path forward. Whoa, 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 whoa. What did it say about dodging? RT and then something, something or another? Old LT. Oh, sweet. So we do have a barrel roll ability as well. Neat. Okay. 
So I've got to get past that. Oh my goodness, that's a lot of enemies. Hey, what's up, guys? How y'all doing? Name's Logan, and I spin to win. I do like that there's a dodge ability, though. That's sweet. So now I can either parry or just barrel roll out of the way. And then I have a dash ability. Like, I'm telling you guys, the combat is very, very impressive. Like, I, I, I'm extremely impressed by the fact that this is a much older game, and yet it has some pretty cool combat mechanics that I genuinely did not expect. Dang it. Ooh, right into the spin attack. Dang. That Machete Champion had a lot of health. All right. So it definitely looks like there's a rope here. But before I do that, I do want to just take a quick peek and see. Oh, huh, why are these things green? Oh, because I think you could use them as um, weapons against enemies. That's kind of crazy. All right. Well, there's really only one path to go, and that would be climbing the rope here. So I guess we scale. And then we jump. And then we scale. And then we jump. Okay. We're through. Hello. Oh boy. Whoa. Oh man. I don't know why. I, 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 for some reason, I had enough rage meter. And I was like, I'm just going to wait for that guy to jump. And then when they're all bunched up, we'll just hit him with a spin. But. Ah, uh, yeah, I didn't have enough energy for that, did I? Can't go this way. And that leaves then only one path forward. Enemy defeated. And victory secured. All right. Through the creepy tunnels we go. Once again, another rope that we can scale. Well, let's take the... I was going to say the stairs up, but this is even worse than taking the stairs. Because we're literally taking a rope up. Imagine if that's what we had to do. Imagine if they didn't invent stairs. Or elevators, for that matter. And anytime you wanted to scale something something or go somewhere <laughs> that requires a little bit of height, you actually had to climb a rope. I guess we'd all be in extremely good shape, though, so that's kind of the good thing. Oh, my goodness. That's a huge leap. Whoa, sick. So we can actually jump into a lunge and then chain it into a throw attack as well. Dang. Okay, that's pretty cool. Again, going back to the point I made about the complexity of the combat continues to impress me. There's more and more depth to it. Okay, here we go. I'm just going to barrel roll out of the way. Come at me. Oof, I was trying to hit him on that. Did not work. There's some good damage. Come at me. Ow. Oh! <laughs> well, uh, you've been defeated. See ya. Yeah, those machete champions are no joke. They're almost like little mini boss fights to a certain extent. And I know I'm saying this and whenever we inevitably reach our first boss fight, like proper boss fight, I'm sure they'll seem like no problem at all. Ooh, some more dog tags here. Another 500 XP. That's very nice. All right, so we can take a huge leap here. Dang, that looks cool. All right, 
So we need to find a crank that attaches onto there. Get some more rage orbs right here. So I, I suppose we'll probably find that somewhere back here and then we'll bring it back. Yep. There we go. Bob, get out of my way. Oh no. I love that Wolverine said Bob. Keeping it classy. All right. So there's the crank that was necessary for this wheel to operate properly. And now we're going to have to do the exact same trick as before. We open up the door and then we do a couple of barrel rolls forward before that thing comes crashing down on us, which is pretty nice. Uh, what the heck are you? I mean, I guess your name tag appeared, so that's kind of nice. You're a Leviathan! Oh my goodness. How much health do you have? Oh, you have too much health. What the heck? That was one stop! That's most of my health bar! No! Move, Logan! Move! Okay. I have to heal. I have to be smart and heal first. I'm gonna let him charge at us. And we're gonna do a barrel roll to get out of the way. Get a couple of swipe attacks in. And then move! You've got to move. I really think rolling out of the way is faster than dashing out of the way. Oof. Okay. I've almost got hit one of his health bars down. It looks like. What, does he change forms or something? Oh, great. Oh, that's just wonderful. Oh my goodness. Wait, okay, so I cannot jump right at him. Got it. N not if I don't want to get absolutely destroyed. Oh my goodness. Okay, so what I have to hope, I think... Maybe when he's holding on to the giant boulder, that's when I could jump. Oh, here we go! Ouch. Jump up. We get out of the way. All right. Every time that I think I've got it figured out, he then immediately readjusts and makes life Difficult. Jump up there. Okay. Come on, charge at me. Get up there. Slice, dice, slice, dice. Spin attack. Doesn't work. Can't do the spin attack. I can, however, go back in. A little bit of damage. Ow! Dang it. How did he catch us? We were off to the side. No! Okay, you gotta move, Wolverine. This is probably risky. One more. Just one more dodge. Dang it. I was too slow on that one. Here 
we go. This should be it. Okay. I feel like Kratos now. I'm drawing all these comparisons to PlayStation games, which probably tells you that I'm kind of enjoying this game. Like, it's pretty well done. Sir, this is Logan. I'm at the rendezvous point, but there's no sign of Creed. Yeah. I love how casual he is after fighting a big giant lava monster. Logan, this is Wraith. It looks like your brother's already on the area with explosives. I'd hightail out of there before it blows. You heard the man, Logan. Find a way off that rock and get to the river. You don't Look, I just realized time. something. When did we get up? When did we get the tank top? Did we pick that up from like one of our enemies or something? I don't even know. Okay. Ooh. Not that enemy on the way in as he jumped up. Direct them. What have we here? Is this a little hidden prize, possibly? Some more dog tags. More XP. Love it. That's awesome. Okay, I do see that big giant zip line. Huh. Interesting. Can we jump onto that? Okay. Quick reaction time. Before we go there. Anything of significance over here? It doesn't seem like it. All right. Time to slide. <laughs> okay, that's like a cheesy 90s action movie. There's, there's no reason for that thing to explode there, but okay. Pal, you got big. Hello. Ah. You're going into the water. Oh, I think I just figured out a way to defeat the machete champions with one shot. They are made out of lava, so it would make sense that they would be weak to water, I guess, right? That checks out. Bro, are we going onto a boat? I think we are. How's Logan been swimming? I guess we're going to find out. Watch this one. Watch this one. As I was saying. Oh. Okay. Are you kidding me right now? <laughs> Holy moly. This is. Oh. Okay. Hey, I don't know if. I, I don't know if Logan can. Operate a boat, but I guess he can operate a machine gun. Oh, boom. That'll do. Bada beam, bada boom. See ya. See ya. Hey. What? What? Okay, wait. It's like inverted controls. Like, this is not an airplane. Why would the controls be inverted? Get to the chopper! Or, I guess in this case, get off the boat! What the hell are you waiting for, huh? Come on, let's do this. Oh! Broski to the rescue! Rescue. Ouch. See ya and see ya. Hey, who can name the name of that character? He's also an X-Man villain, I guess. Rogue. Leave that in the comment section below if you know your X-Man knowledge. Day's gonna come, little brother. I won't always be there to help you. Don't worry, though. You're the same as me. You just don't know it yet. Ooh, super dramatic conclusion there.
Three years later, Canada. No, why don't you enlighten me? That's in my neck of the woods. The moon had a lover, Kwekuachu, but Trickster wanted the moon for himself. So he suggested Kwekuachu come to our world and pick her some wild roses. Never trust a guy named Trickster. Kwekuachu found out that once you leave the spirit world, you cannot return. So now he's trapped here, doomed to howl at the moon forever. Cuckoo Kachu got screwed. <laughs> the Wolverine. Kayla, run. Don't ask why, just run. But Logan. Go! Uh oh. You. Hey, little brother. Long time no see. Uh, have you ever heard of a manicure? There we go! Nice little counter. Okay. Oh, I can't even do the leap attack against them. I love that every time we hit the jukebox, the song changes. <laughs> Again, incredible attention to detail. Spin. Got him. Or maybe not. Were you supposed to be attacking me there, dude? Oh. Hey, get off me, bro. Come on! Oh, we're laying the smack down on this guy now. We just went berserk mode. Come on, dude. I think I countered that. Ooh, that seems like it would have hurt, right? Dang it. Not much I can do while still being knocked down. But once we get back up, I get back up. I did a counter into a counter. He countered our offense, I countered his. Oh, that hurts. Ouch. Boom. Got enough energy to spin. Man, my healing time seems to be slower than what it was during the mission. I wonder if that means that I can also do a. Oh, ow, 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 ow. <laughs> I wonder if it means that I could do a lunge attack too, since we're outside now. Ouch. Ow. I mean, it's like getting beat up by a tree. Insert, I am Groot here. So this is clearly pre-adamantium Wolverine. Now, where'd your old lady get to? We 
Thanks, Kayla. Stay with me. You're okay. You're okay. No, Logan, she isn't. Striker. I came to warn you. You knew he was coming? Victor's appetites were becoming too public. We had to confine him. He felt betrayed, went AWOL, said he's coming for all of us. So you didn't come to warn me. You came to save your own ass. He killed Wade. You were supposed to be next. Wade? Which Wade could he be referring to there, guys? What's your plan, Captain? I'm going to find him and kill him. You already tried. You can't beat him, Logan. You know you can't. But there is another option. I can give you the tools to defeat him. I can promise you two things. You will suffer more pain than any other man could endure. Your bones will be coated in adamantium. When we're done, you'll be able to withstand anything. This looks so freaking cool. Where did you fight him, my best box? It's more important to me than his life. Don't even think about what the hell. Stand down, Captain. My brother, my responsibility. At my command. The operation was a success, but he can't be trusted. We have his DNA for Weapon 11. Terminate him. Ooh, here we go. They didn't bet on this now, did they? Everyone on the line, go, go, go. Weapon X facility. Welcome Weapon X himself. We got a new ability, Berserk. Let's try it. Oh. Oh, Berserk is pretty powerful. Hey, there's some dog tags over here. Thank you. I'll take those off you. Feral senses are working. You guys thought it was bad when he was regular Wolverine. Now he's on a Mantium Wolverine. Good luck. Health increased by five. And I have two skill points to apply. I don't know what I get to apply my skill points on. But we'll figure it out. You now have skill points to allocate in the skills menu. Would you like to go there now? It's just hilarious that I just mentioned it and it immediately pops up. That's really funny. All right. So the character menu allows you to upgrade and customize Wolverine. You can spend skill points, equip mutagens, keep the track, sorry, keep track of combat reflexes and browse your unlocked fighting moves. Okay. Very cool. So let's see what our skills are actually like. Upgrade Wolverine's fury attacks and, att uh, and attributes by spending skill points you gain from leveling up. All right, so there's a plethora of abilities available. We're also kind of being spoiled on some of the other abilities we'll get, like the Claw Cyclone, it looks like, and the Claw Drill, which sounds very, very powerful. Um, and then we have current upgrade. So we have the Claw Spin. We can upgrade the duration of it or the damage. It sounds pretty good, but we can't afford it right now because it actually requires three and four points of skill. And then we have Berserk upgrade as well as attack damage upgrade. Then we have health, claw damage, and rage. I won't mind to upgrade our damage, so I think that'll be pretty good. That's your skills. What's our mutagen abilities? Mutagens are powerful items that can boost Wolverine or give him new abilities. Use this many to equip any mutagens you've found hidden throughout the levels. Additional mutagen slots will unlock as Wolverine levels up. Holy moly, look how many of them there are! Healing Factor, Inner Rage, Samurai, Experience. Oh, I jumped into Reflex. Hold up. Mutagens. I don't have any of these unlocked, but dang. Okay. That's a lot of stuff to be on the lookout for. All right. And then Reflexes increases Wolverine's skill at fighting machete enemies. Okay. 
increases Wolverine's skill at fighting machine gunners. Okay. And then increases skill at fighting jungle mutants, Leviathan, Hunter, and Shifter. So I think the way that this works is that the more of them we defeat, then we hit levels. So like, for example, with this one, we're level one. That's why you have that little claw mark there. I think that's kind of how it works, which is interesting. Um, and then last but certainly not least, we have our fighting moves here, which there is a lot. Oh my goodness. Oh my good. It just keeps going. Oh, you can lock on. Wait, does that mean I could? No, but this is just for lunge attacks. Okay, cool. I was wondering if you could lock, like, lock on for um, the purposes of, like, fighting, but I don't think so. I think that's only for lunging. So that's okay, though. R, B, L, B, and Y for a lunge finishing attack. Okay. That's pretty crazy sounding. And we have some grapple abilities here. Here's our blocking. And then we have some air attacks. Dodge and dash. As well as ground attack. So again, pretty extravagant set of skills. Uh, your skills have changed. Keep the changes or discard. We're going to keep the changes. And then we're going to get to rumbling with this group of Strikers Army. There's an astounding number of enemies, which does make things... A little bit more challenging, but all things considered, we handled our business. Can we pick this up? Okay. Can't go through there. I can, however, open this door up. Oh, I don't know if we wanted to. That was a beautiful combo. Okay. That door is closed. That is the door I'm supposed to go through. Oh, that door is not closed. Here's the elite commando. And who's that? I assume an elite commando. Bub. Is this supposed to be a Hydra Bob? That would be hilarious. Is that more impressive? Countered. See ya. Oh, wait. I wasn't Sia yet. I thought I had him. Spin to win. Command, we're taking casualties. Send reinforcements. Anything else of interest here? I don't think so. I mean, you can destroy some of this stuff, I guess, for just some rage orbs and stuff, so that's kind of neat. But beyond that, not really anything that we need to be interested in. Logan, this is Colonel Stryker. Do you mind explaining what in blazes you're doing? Um, You've killed my men. Coming after you. Some very expensive equipment. You're out of control. Log, Captain Stand William up. Stryker. I'm pushing forward with assembling my squad of mutants. High command is dubious, but they're willing to let me run with it for a few more months. All right, so Striker's clearly working on putting together a team. Both have regenerative powers and one of them. I can't seem to go through there. Why does this look like a trap here? He's in. Dang it. Great. Combat reflexes have upgraded. Got him. Hey, I don't know who the target visibility being removed 
helps more. Because wouldn't they not be able to see Wolverine as good either? Here we go. I think I countered that. And considering I have Berserk mode on, I should be doing extra damage. All right. Fortunately enough, we can use our Feral Senses ability to see quite perfectly clear, which I suppose Striker didn't know about when he ha hatched this plan of using um, the smoke and stuff. What enemy is this? It's not Deadpool, is it? That's the Wade that I was referring to a little earlier. Got him. I got him too. And another one bites the dust. Use cover. Oh, got him. Okay, we got to get into cover here a little bit. Just to heal up a wee little bit back. I'm going through here. I'm like, maybe there's some cool Easter egg that we missed. Definitely don't want to miss that. Really? You almost got who? Definitely not me. And we've almost leveled up. Has is this open? Hello. Boom! Got him. Uh, maybe that's dead. Really? scientific minds would have us believe that the appearance of homo superior is little more than an aberration but what if they're wrong what if the number of mutants continues to increase and what if they become even more powerful to the point where they determine we're no longer necessary the incident with the team in africa has shown me that mutants are incapable of being trusted we humans must take steps to protect ourselves okay can we go through here? Yep, more dog tags. That's 500 XP, which I think is enough to level up. Let's go. Awesome. That's going to be another skill point collected. Fantastic. There's another work log here, which I think do a good job of explaining Striker's motivations, I guess. Greetings, Senator Kelly. And to what do I owe this visit? The project I've been put in charge of is in need of additional test material. <laughs> I was wondering if perhaps we might be able to make a trade. I see. And what do you have in exchange That's for a cool move. my test material? I can give you the location of a school that's a training ground for young mutants. Oh! That sounds like Persephor... Persephor? Professor Xavier's school. school. And if it turns out to be everything you say, then we'll have a deal. Okay. I'm just going to try to get some rage orbs there. And oh my goodness, whatever the heck that is, that's probably not going to be friendly. I'm guessing, right? I mean, there's no way that that thing just pops up and goes like, Hi, I'm Colossus. And ends up being like friendly somehow. I want to try to roll and do the... That's so cool! I can now roll and attack at the same time. With that spin move. That's sick. Blastor needs a power cell. I mean, Logan, 
There's not much time. Who are you? You were injected with a poison while you were in the adamantium tank. Okay. I can help you, but first you have to come to my lab. I'll unlock a door for you. And Thank be you. careful. They've sent ghost squads. Oh, so that's the way we're going. I don't know. This can't open, right? Okay. So I guess at least for now, we don't have to worry about whatever the heck that is. Hello. New enemy type? Ghost. All right. Let's see how fancy you are. What are you, like, invisible? Like you're dead. Whoa! <laughs> that was awesome! That was sick! Use too much cologne. Activating cloak now. Okay, I guess we're gonna have to use our feral essence. Got him! I can see, I can smell you. Another one bites the dust. I actually think I did hit him there. Just barely, but I did. Sent him flying. Come on. Dang it. That guy literally just finessed right by me somehow. How did I not see him? Okay, let's get some rage orbs. Wait, can we send him into the tanks there? I think we could have thrown him into this. Would have been interesting. Just for damage wise. Ooh, another striker log. I think. Dr. Abraham Cornelius. We are now at Never mind. Test subject 23 of the Wendigo prototype series. I have reason to believe the serum will be a success. Due to a new combination in the nucleotide sub. I think that's our first if mutagen. Well. Unlocked. I guess things didn't go very well <laughs> with that experiment. Yeah, it doesn't sound like it went well. Let's listen to this work log instead. Authorized by Captain William Stryker. Dr. Cornelius, what do you make of this new applicant? Dr. Carol Frost. She's certainly bright enough. Graduated in the top 1% of her class. She passed her physical and psychological tests. But... But what? She shows a tendency for compassion. It could cloud her judgment towards the test subject. Everyone on me! I need suppressing fire. Okay. Got a situation. Having to fight these guys. This is not going to break open, is it? Yep, just stay there and we're all good. Our cell goes in. Hey, that was kind of surprising. I genuinely legitimately expected that thing to go off. Legitimately. See ya. Another one bites the dust. Oh, is this one going to be the one that opens up and attacks? This seems like a mighty big room, which usually indicates boss fight time. Right? Yep! Hey, it's the Wendigo! Oh my goodness! Looks like Titan Joker. Alright, come at me, dude. Dang it. Okay, good counter. Here we go. Oh, 
Ow. Hey, I almost got him. Got him this time and leveled up from it. Should have stayed out of my Ooh. way. Ooh. All right. Yeah, that was a challenge. Not gonna lie. We can't open this, right? I should have been able to counter that. Uh, I think we got them all. Dash in there. Just for cover. Don't let him get away. And they got work logs everywhere. Hey, I did press LT there. There we go. And enemy defeated. Ooh. Is this a dead end? Seems like that's uh, Dr. Frost there again. Can you hear me? Yep. Uh, who the hell are you? I'm Dr. Carol Frost, and I work for Dr. Cornelius. I think I can help you. What's happening to me? Uh. As an insurance policy against you escaping, Stryker had you injected with a bioenzyme. It just activated and destroyed what now? regeneration and feral senses. I can repair the damage, but you must meet me in my lab north of here. Now why should I trust you? Because if you don't, you'll die. <laughs> well, that's a pretty compelling reason. <laughs> You've lost your regeneration? Oh, that was the worst time to lose regeneration with that little amount of health left. You know? The mission to Angola was a success. The indigenous personnel were reluctant to reveal the location of the mineral. But in the end, we got what we came for. There was some collateral damage. A military advisor paid the ultimate price in service to her country. Also, a team member left due to combat fatigue. He'll be kept under surveillance for possible activation at a later date. Get into position! All right, we're just gonna go sneak through. We're not fighting these guys. As long as this thing doesn't just like suddenly collapse here, just because of you have to imagine the amount of weight the Wolverine weighs with his adamantium would be pretty ridiculous. But I guess these vents are uh, strong enough to hold his weight. All right, we stealth our way through that. This seems to need a power cell. Oh boy. Where's the power cell, I guess? There's a vent. Can we push this up here? Or no? Oh, it's up there. I see it. Is that not enough to... There we go. Can I... Hold up, actually. Can I go up here? Ooh, what's that? Is that another mutagen thing? Healing factor one. Decreases cooldown time before regeneration starts. You found a mutagen! Oh, so this is the first mutagen. Okay. So I guess that other thing that we found was just some sort of... Uh, just a permanent health boost, which is, hey, I don't mind. Five extra HP sounds good to me. Considering how we uh, go berserk and fight these fights, I think every little bit of health is appreciated. All right, power cell goes in. Power cell opens the door. Nice. There is a vent up here, which is interesting, because it does make me think... Uh, Maybe there's a way to get up there, but it doesn't seem to actually let me jump onto those boxes. 
and I don't think I could go through there. And the thing that stinks is that because of our um, abilities being suppressed right now, we don't even have feral senses, so we can't even use that to kind of go into like detective mode type thing. Okay, another power cell necessary here. Um, can I just bring the one that we placed there or no? I guess that's the first question. Actually, I think I've got an idea how to do this. So what we're going to do is we're going to push the this in the way. So it almost functions as a placeholder. Or when inevitably this door is going to try to close when we remove the power cell, I think. So if we grab this, it's probably going to close. Yep, or try to. Okay. And then we just place this here. And we're going up. I don't think there's any reason to go here. Whoops, okay. That was a waste. But I had to check. Maybe there was something of relevance there. Oh my goodness. Okay, we're gonna try to be sneaky here. Go oh, a little bit more stealth based. Not that I really have an option. Can I at least get my ray? Oh, I can't. And we can't regenerate either, so this is just not great. Checkpoint reached. Can I hide here or something? No. Okay, so that door's closed, but this is the only one that's open, so I guess we go through. And this is the meeting between Logan and Angel. Carol Frost. I simply want to help. Wait, you don't understand. I want to stop the atrocities they're committing here, and I'm starting with you. What's that do? It will deactivate the bioenzyme. All right. Do it. You're safe now. If you go to the biomechanics lab, I'll repair your healing ability. Hey, Doc. This turns out to be a trap. I will hunt you down. Then I have nothing to worry about. I brought your things. All right. Frosty reception. Objective complete, and we got to retire. Cool. Here's some more work logs, it looks like. Authorized by Dr. Abraham Cornelius. Adamantium. Are you certain such a metal even exists? Yes. It's extremely rare, but... Yes. Dr. McLean's notes were quite clear. Bonding that metal to bone must be beautiful. Very much so. But more importantly, the process damages all the surrounding tissue. Sounds like it would kill a normal man. Indeed it would. But who says we need to use a normal man? Okay, and we have one more war clock. I just read the surveillance reports on former members of Team X. It breaks my heart to see what depths these men have sunk into. Wraith is running a gym. Dukes has an eating disorder and Bradley works at a carnival. Perhaps the most pitiful of all is Logan. He had such potential. How do we even do this? Going to waste while he hides in the wilderness. Ooh, can we break that? Interesting. Ooh, what's that? Is that another mutagen? Rampage 1 increases your maximum rage. You found another mutagen. Nice. Cool. So I think I should be able to probably sneak up on this enemy here. Ta-da. Wait, how? That was a stealth takedown. Gotta love Striker making fun of his uh, task team. We're working at a carnival. How can they expect me to complete my work when my hands are tied by so many rules and regulations? I'm on the verge of a revolutionary breakthrough, and they're worried about human rights. 
Well, the pet subjects are not humans. They're mutants. Legally, they have no rights. Okay, Striker. We'll see about that. Oh, here's another one of those thingies. Okay, so this right here, I guess just gives us permanent maximum HP boost, which is pretty nice. Another set of dog tags, which means another 500 XP. That's cool. Attention. Additional support staff is needed in the weapon. Oh boy. Hold up. I saw something in there. It's nothing. Just a portable turret. I don't know. Weapon X has got you seeing things. Let's get the hell out of here. All right, so I can probably dash. All non-military personnel in this sector evacuate to the Alkali Lake compound immediately. Ta-da! Did that pretty much perfectly. Ooh, there's a power cell. Don't know where we need to bring that. facility was when I first interviewed here. They gave me a tour today, and I discovered that 90% of it's underground. The place is huge. The people here are very skilled, and the equipment is top of the line. Some of it I didn't even know existed. I also met Captain Stryker for the first time. Unlike Dr. Cornelius, who's always struck me as a bit of a cold fish. Captain Oof. Okay, so that did not work. Okay, so it seems like I was correct. We won't be able to just barrel roll past that point. I did try one more time and then realized that there's a computer here that has some shield controls. So, I think what we're supposed to do is utilize the shield controls and then move. I don't know how far we have to move this, I guess. That's kind of... Maybe here would be... Ish, okay. Code red security status. All military oh, I see. Okay, so it's going to move with us. Understood. Okay. That's pretty clear then. All right, so we're just going to put that there and then book it as it moves. And we're just going to basically move along with it. Not too quick. Yay! Ooh! Okay. So made it through there. I guess I just have to jump up here into the vent area, right? Maybe. Stay alert just in case. He's up there! Whoa, 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 whoa. What the hell are you doing? All Viper squads, rendezvous and detention. Just destroy that vent. That's us. Let's move Everyone's to running around pissing themselves over Weapon X. <laughs> Too bad that son of a bitch wasn't here right now. Oh, really? Just how would it go? Uh, how would it go? Like that? Is that what you planned for? Ta da! All non military personnel in okay. I guess we'll make our way down here now. Man, not having regeneration ability is such a difference maker. It really, really is. Like, it's stunning how much of a difference it makes. What does this do, by the way? Will this lower this shield? Can I th throw this? No, I cannot. Huh. I mean... This is bizarre. Let's check upstairs just to double check that there's nothing there. Um, yep, there's kind of nothing to interact with. Okay. And what exactly did turning this green do? Oh, it powers up this computer. Okay. Simply close the gap first. Then destroy this thing. And then we're good to go, right? Ooh, there's another action figure right there. A test subject was brought in to me today. He spoke, which is incredible considering the amount of sedatives he was given. It was difficult to understand him, but it sounded as if he wasn't a volunteer. He's a prisoner. 
If that's true, then I need to rethink what I'm doing here at Weapon X. Hey, you should have thought about that a little earlier, no? You found a legendary Wolverine action figure, one of two. Find both of them in order to unlock a bonus challenge. Okay. There's clearly a path here. However, what's up here? Because I am intrigued to take a look at least. Oh, is this another mutagen? Vitality one. Dang, they are giving out a lot of these mutagens, man. We got three of them now. It's pretty exciting. And this looks like another lab. There's not much time. Place your arms in that machine. Time to regenerate. Engaged. Hey. Relax. This will reactivate your healing abilities. Open up. Open the door. Uh, you better hurry up with that. I have to go, but I'll meet you at the neurochemistry lab. Good luck, Logan. Um, what about the regeneration abilities? Phase one complete. Phase two complete. Hurry up! Phase three complete. Process terminated. And. Bada beam, bada boom. Let's get ready to rumble, guys. Oh, unfortunately for you, though, regeneration I works. I can't believe it. He's dead. Yeah, we did it. Target is Command. down. Command. Weapon X is dead. I repeat, Weapon X is dead. What is he going to do? Take a selfie? <laughs> hey, somebody take my oh. picture. Yeah. Sure, send me a copy. Yeah, tag me on Instagram. All right. Let's get ready to rumble. Ba boom. Okay, we win that. Dang, that was a good dodge. I ain't gonna lie. Pretty well dodged there. And jump up there. But I should be able to deal with this enemy and collect a new pair of dog tags, which will give us another boost in our XP. And that leaves, I think, just this guy, right? Our feral senses are still not back. I guess maybe that's the final thing that uh, Carol Frost is supposed to fix. Is Wolverine's sense of... Smell. Alright, we've defeated them all. Kinda. Ta-da! Eat at him. Where you at? Did they go through this door? I think they did. But I almost think we're gonna just double back. Oh, feral senses are finally back. Let's go, I think. Oh no. That's the name of the next objective, I guess, is feral senses. I thought it said ability unlocked. Got him. Um, I got these guys too. Pretty easy. Handled business there. Moving along. Dang it. I guess we'll fight this guy first. And defeat this dude. Can't go through this door, it doesn't seem like. Um, so I guess... I 
think that's where I'm supposed to go, but let's take a tiny little detour and see where this may lead. Is this the same lab? I think it is, right? It just circles back. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay. I guess it kind of like loops back up. Clear that whole wave. But uh, we don't have feral senses, which does make things a little bit annoying. Because when they use the smoke abilities, we legitimately cannot see the enemies. Hit a checkpoint. Get some uh, rage orbs. I mean, I guess, thank goodness we can heal now. That's definitely uh, nice. Ooh, dog tags. Definitely get that. Another 500 XP, and that's enough to level up. Sweet. We have six skill points to spend, so let's take a quick pause and actually apply some of those. So, I'm thinking, thinking upgrading this would be smart. I think health would be nice as well. So what we could do is we could go one upgrade for the claws and then one for health and one for rage. And that applies our skills across the board and we kind of get a nice boost to everything, which I think is smart. Okay, so move into here where it seems like it's a trap. Oof. There we go. I can at least remotely see the enemy. This is crazy. Fighting them like this without the feral senses is legitimately a way different challenge. There we go. Charge at him. Got him. I think that's all of them. Nope, not yet. Got him. That was the last one. Enemy defeated. Ooh. Got another work log here. Dang it. Another one bites the dust. What have we here? Another health boost. Sweet. Very nice. Um, still don't have a sense. For being able to know exactly where we're supposed to go, but. Do some reverse engineering here. If the enemies came from here, that would imply that we are supposed to go down this path. Oh. Yep! Large number of enemies. Into the lunge attack. Defeated that guy. What have we here? More dog tags. that the doctor's work is based on research done by Dr. Nathaniel Essex, a man who joined the project back when it Logan, we have to hurry. Soldiers are on their way. Sit it's here. time to this get the feral essence ability back, senses. please. Oh, great. I wonder what Captain Stryker would say if he found out that... I have to leave, but the procedure will only take a few minutes. When it's done, you can exit through that door. Thanks for helping me, Doc. Logan? There's a little girl locked up in this sector who needs help, too. Take her with you. Come on. I don't have time to play babysitter. 
What's going on with Logan's lip there? <laughs> oh, this is cool. The helmet? That's sick. She needs you. This is like the classic um comic book attire. I wish we would have kept the helmet there. Alright, we got our feral abilities back. Are you serious right now? You guys dodge everything. Got him. Okay. Dude, that's crazy. The attention to detail there is really interesting the way that they'll actually attack you even when they're down on the ground. Like as they're getting up, they're still going to fire on Logan. That's kind of neat because I feel like most of the time in video games, enemies will kind of like, once you knock them down, they don't really attack you until they get back up. That's kind of unique. At least it feels like it. Got him. Whoo! What a way to complete that fight. Oh, did I just level up again? Yes, I did. I think so. See ya, dude. Probably doesn't know how to fly, I would imagine. Barrel sense. Oof. Yeah, dude. Um, okay, we definitely need to wig cross. Clear those crates to get some more rage. And I think we are safe to proceed this way. Oh, brand new enemy class, the Grenadier. Oh. Attention. Okay, that left a ringing noise in our ears. Boom! That took care of that situation, I think. What's going on with you, dude? Oh, that's a new TikTok dance right there. She's probably coming soon to the Fortnite item shop. The um, what are these? These seem almost like little cages or something like that. I don't know. Right? I feel like there'd be a collectible inside one of them, but I guess not. Would have been nice to find that other uh, action figure that we're missing. What is this? Is this another mutagen? I think it is. Experience one. Gain extra experience from each kill you found a mutagen. Oh. Do we have spots for another mutagen or are we still limited to just one? No, we're still limited to just one. So, uh, no choice there. Although I do kind of want to equip this one just because I feel like this will be really, really good in terms of being able to level up. And I don't feel like I've really struggled that much with health wise. Like I feel like we're doing pretty good because we have regeneration. So we do. Okay. Um, is this the character we're supposed to rescue here? I think so. I'm Logan. Who are you? Anna. Well, you must be the one Dr. Frost was talking about. Dr. Carol said she'd come for me. <sighs> she lied. Let me see what I can do, kid. Oh, uh, Mr. Logan. Oh, okay. I need you to close your eyes and don't open them until I say so, all right? Okay, Mr. Logan. Okay, here we go. <laughs> Let's get Next ready to rumble. Face someone your own size. Um, hello. 
That's one. Come on. I'm gonna kind of... You're gonna go or... There we go. Reflect that back. Takes care of him. And so that only leaves you as an enemy that we need to defeat. Is that it? Ta da! Rescue operation completed! I did what you said, Mr. Logan. I kept my eyes closed and never looked up. Oh, good job, kid. I'm proud of you. Now, why don't we get you out of here, huh? I can help. I saw which way to go when they brought me in. Hey, what the. Whoa! What the. Did you know what's <laughs> funny? Moved us, if that's what you mean. Think you could move us through that door? Not right now. Moving us both makes me really tired. No problem. Just stay here while I go to that control room and open the door. I can get there by myself really quick. No, wait, I can... Look out! Oh, no. We have the girl, Colonel Stryker. 